Steve Irwin's parents found an emotional letter addressed to them, ten years following the death of the crocodile hunter. Today, Thursday, February 22, marks what would have been the legendary conservationist's 62nd birthday if he hadn't been killed back in 2006 at the age of 44. He had been pierced in the chest by a short tail stingray while filming the ocean's deadliest underwater documentary in the Great Barrier Reef. Steve left behind his beloved wife of 14 years Terry, and their two young children, Bindi and Robert Irwin. While his mum Lynn Irwin had died in a car accident in February 2000, Steve was outlived by his father Bob Irwin who's now 84 years old. Much like his famous son, Bob has a passion for wildlife and in 2016, he was conducting research for his memoir The Last Crocodile Hunter, a father and son legacy. It was during his search for more information that he discovered an unopened letter that fell from a book, a message Steve had written for his mum and dad Bob and Lynn. When he was 32, he wrote, Probably one of the most unfortunate things in a bloke's life is that it takes over 30 years to realize how essential you have been to build my character, my ethics and, most importantly, my happiness. At 32, I am finally starting to figure it out. In good times and in bad, you were there. The emotional letter continued. Your strength and endurance to raise me will not go unrewarded. My love for you is my strength. For the rest of my life, I will reflect on the unbelievably great times we've shared and will continue to share. You're my best friends. Bob had been sharing his story with Amanda French who co-authored his memoir during a 20,000 km road trip. He said, Working on this book I have been constantly reminded of Steve's boundless energy, infectious humor and unrestrained passion for wildlife.